guys, it's me, your chef Ryan. Welcome to the vlog. So today we are going to share the story of Lucio San Pedro. We have here a beautiful lady, Miss Shirley. Hi guys, I'm Shirley. It's Lucio San Pedro. Lucius San Pedro, born in Angono Rizal on February 11, 1913, was a great Filipino composer, conductor, and teacher. He is a popular for his contribution to the field of Philippine music, just as the Lulabi, Sa Ogur Nanduyana, made with another national artist for music, Libby Silario and the Symphonic Poem, Lahing Kayumangi. He composed many different types of music, including Siphonic, band, vocal, choral, theater, chamber, and movie, all which both Filipino Bride and Soul. His popular work, including orchestral music, The Devil's Bride, Malakas at Maganda Overture, Prelude and Fugi in D minor, and Hope and Ambition, choral music, Easter Cantata, Samahal Kung Bayan, and Rizal Valedictory Poem, vocal music, Lolay, In the Silence of the Night, and the band music, Dance of the Fairies, Tramfical March and Angonian March. No stranger to the music world since birth, Lucio belonged to a family with strong musical influence. During his late teen years, he became a church organist and started composing songs, hymns, and two complete masses for voice and orchestra. After studying under different musicians in the Philippines, he proceeds to the Juilliard School of the Music in New York City as a scholar and learned advanced composition under Bernard Wegener in 1947. He also studied harmony and orchestration under Vittorio Giannini. Apart from composing music, Losho also developed a passion for teaching. He taught composition in numerous conservatories and universities, just as Ate Ateneo de Manila University, Centro Escolar University, Conservatory of Music, and at, at the University of the Philippines College of Music, where we come chairman its, its composition and conducting department from 1973. 70 to 1973, he retired as a professor in 1978 and received the title of Professor em Emeritus in UP the following year. His numerous works, influences, and contribution to Philippine music led to the proclamation of Lucius San Pedro as a national artist of the Philippines for music on May 19, 1991 by President Corazon Aquino. He did at the age of 89 on March 31, 2002, due to cardiac arrest and is buried in his, his own town of Angono. San Pedro came from a family with musical roots and he began his career early when he was still in his late tens. He succeeded his deceased grandfather as the local crunch organs. By then, he had already composed song Heinemans and two complete masses for voices and orchestra. After studying with several prominent musicians in the Philippines, he took advanced composition training with Bernard Wagener of the Netherlands. He also studied harmony and orchestration under Vittorio Giannini and took classic at Juilliard in 1940. <laughs> You're a great legend, and that's all for the story of one of the greatest composer in the Philippines, Lucius and Pedro. See you in my next vlog.